Yo, what up? Casey here with Living Youthful. Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, please hit that subscribe button. So today I have a very important topic that we need to discuss and it's how beneficial or how effective are these BPC-157 capsules? We're gonna go over the bioavailability and also what makes them stable. I wanna be able to give you guys accurate information on this so that way hopefully you won't have any more questions. We're also gonna be going over a dosage range for these capsules off of research to be able to help repair wounded tissue and inflammation. All right, so let's just do a minor dive of the effectiveness of these BPC-157 capsules and their bioavailability, okay? So BPC-157 is a derivative of a natural protein known as BPC, body protective compound. One of the best aspects of BPC-157 is its oral bioavailability, which is uncommon among most peptides. Peptides typically face two major challenges that prevent them from being effective when taken orally stability and bioavailability. The stability of BPC-157 has never been questioned. While gut and stomach acids can destroy many peptides through petrolysis, BPC is a natural gut peptide designed from the stomach environment and is naturally present there. In other reports with BPC-157, it has high bioavailability when administered either orally or subcutaneously. This compound is resistant to stomach acid, allowing it to be effectively delivered in water or food. Research has demonstrated its benefits in various medical conditions including heart disease, tendon injuries, ligament injuries, eye diseases, central nervous system disorders, and inflammatory bowel diseases. BPC-157 is advancing our understanding of multiple organ systems and it has opened new research pathways for treating and preventing diseases. So this is another very important topic, enteric coating. So an enteric coating, also known as gastro-resistant coating, is a barrier applied to oral peptides that controls the location in the digestive tract where it is absorbed. The term enteric refers to the small intestine. Therefore, enteric coatings resist breakdown before it reaches the small intestine. Researchers developed an arginate salt of BPC-157. The BPC-157 arginate salt is highly stable in the human gastric juice and increases the oral bioavailability to over 90%. That's just giving you an idea of how high the bioavailability is of these capsules, how effective. Also talking about the arginate salt, which makes them much more stable, and then also the enteric coatings, which allow them to make it into the small intestine and being able to be absorbed. So hopefully that was helpful, brought you guys some clarity and some knowledge. All right, so off of research, let's jump into a dosage range for acute tears, severe injuries, wounded tissue, recovery and repair, okay? So typically most soft tissue injuries heal in 30 to 90 days. 30 days of research with BPC-157 capsules is the minimum for mild injuries and 60 to 90 days is recommended for more significant injuries. This duration applies to tendons, muscles, ligaments, gut lining, and inflammatory gut conditions. All right, now let's jump into the real dosage range. So research indicates that acute tears and severe injuries may require an initial dosage of one to two capsules in the morning, followed by another one to two capsules in the evening for 30 days. If healing is still taking longer after 30 days, reducing the dosage to one to two capsules may be required. Generally, 60 days is considered an optimal healing period, but recovery may take longer up to 90 days, depending on the individual and the severity of the injury. It is important to note that these timelines can vary. Using one to three capsules for at least 30 days has shown promising results for mild injuries, general repair, and recovery purposes. Some studies suggest that taking these after an intense workout can benefit individuals by aiding recovery and reducing inflammation. Everybody has a different severity or condition injury, so it may take longer for others to experience the effectiveness of these capsules or even just BPC-157 than other people. That's why this is a range. Hopefully this has brought you guys some clarity and just some knowledge on this topic and how beneficial or effective is the bioavailability with these capsules. All right. So we've gone over all that. And with that being said, if you guys are interested in other peptides, definitely check out my channel. I've got a few on there and I just want to say thank you guys for everything. If this video has brought you guys value, please hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and we'll see you in the next one. Thank you.